Hello, everybody. <laughs> Welcome to my One Hair Baby yeah. Challenge. This is part 60. I think that this would be the perfect time for her to have a baby, or at least get pregnant. So hopefully we can get her pregnant in part 60. Right now, we are just trying to get, you know, um, to be better friends with this guy. He is just being very difficult so right now we are just gonna talk to him we're gonna become better friends with him and we're really just gonna yeah i don't know just just laid on thick with the um the whole friend thing so and we're gonna discuss interests and he, but he's being very difficult. He's a pleasant conversation, though. Um, uh, boring conversation. Uh oh. Uh oh. Tell engaging story. Um. Huh. I don't know. How are we gonna get? Okay, we need to. We need to make it funny. Um, knock knock joke. Let's make it funny in here. Um, let's tell a funny story. Come on, casual. Um, friend or funny. Do an impression. Come on, come on, find this funny. We're funny. Laugh, dang it. We're funny. Um, let's do another knock knock joke. And let's. Um, still casual. Give a funny gift, maybe? Um, more choices. Funny. Um, tell another funny story. And <laughs> bright and day. I don't know how much you liked that. Um, he's actually been kind of difficult, you guys. Ask about day again. Um, tell an outrageous story. We're, we're going to tell an outrageous story here. Okay, so then now we're going to just... Uh-oh, what's he doing? Where's he going? Is he leaving? Come back here. Um... Let's gossip. I don't know what he's doing, but we want to gossip with him. We're going to share a secret with him. And we're going to... Wow, we already have a choice to ask to to move in. Mm, I don't know. Okay, we're going to try to... We're going to try to flirt with him. And see if he takes the flirt. He did. He took the flirt. Okay. So, But we, we don't want to get overconfident with this. We don't want to get too... Too confident. Um, let's see. What can we do? Um... Let's exchange numbers, and what's something that would be considered romantic, but not um, too overbearing? Okay, so we took that. We're exchanging numbers. And, come on. Ugh. Ugh. Does he not like that either? Okay, he's still feeling playful. What are they doing now? Oh, they're gonna hug. That's fine. Hug. Okay. Um, let's try complimenting appearance and um, gossip. So we just gotta we, we just gotta balance the flirting and the friendly the best we can and hope that he will just accept something. Come on. Oh, this guy, I swear. Um, okay. She's feeling confident. So, um, 
let's try brightening day again and sharing a secret let's give him another gift let's give him a friendly gift we'll give him technical tom i like that and gossip hey at least they're going inside now <laughs> she's like come to my bedroom so i can give you a gift in my bedroom at least he likes it right good okay so let's make a flirtatious joke and let's see if he'll take the flirtatious joke because we're running out of time i really want to have i really want to get pregnant in this part it's part 60 you guys it's part 60 we, we have we have to do that does he, does he like it I don't know if you like that or not. Ooh, he's feeling very flirty now. Um, more choices, romance. Um, let's try complimenting appearance again. And then let's, let's see, romantic. Um, flirt. And if he goes for that, if he likes that. Come on, we're we're appealing, we're appealing, we're very appealing. Ooh, ooh, good, 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 good. Okay, okay. So he seemed to like that. He's in a very flirty mood. So, um, I don't know. If hold hands would be considered a romance. Um, let's blow him a kiss. And. We're going to flirt again, and hopefully he will keep with that. Come on. Okay. Is he trying to leave? Who is this? It's, it, her sister's here. <laughs> it's like, go away. We're trying to, we're, we're, we're trying to flirt and, and like have a baby and stuff. And then we're going to kiss hands. Don't mind my sister there in the background. She's uh, she's just trying to, you know, help me out and um, critique, I guess. <laughs> We're not going to ask a risky question because it seems like every time I do that, it attempt mistletoe kiss. Um, I don't think we're there yet. Um, give a romantic gift. Yeah, chocolate cake is a romantic gift. I'm sorry, not going to happen. Um, da -dum, da -dum, da -dum, da -dum. What else do we want to do? Um, hmm. Uh, we're not going to ask if single because something tells me that that's not going to work. Let's hold hands. Okay. And let's see. Uh, hopefully he takes all of these. And as long as he takes all of these, I could see things happening good for us. Yes. Do we see babies in our future? Do we see babies in our future? Um... Ooh, okay, confess attraction. I don't want to do first kiss just yet. Um, we're going to flirt some more. And let's see. Um, um, we'll hold hands again. And then we're going to attempt first kiss. Hopefully by then we'll be far enough that we can get that first kiss out of the way. He seems to be doing good. Oh my goodness. They got their first kiss. They did their first kiss. Oh, they did. They did. They did. Oh my goodness. Okay. A sexy pose. And um, whisper sed seductively. And flirt again. And um, hold hands again. Oh, we can do this. We can do this. And she's going to get pregnant. We just know it. Aww. Aww. She's laying it on thick. Okay. Uh, let's try for baby in the hot tub. Will they do it? Will they do it? Will they do it? Oh my goodness. Will they do it? And then hopefully, hopefully she's pregnant. If not, I don't know. I'm tempted to ask him to stay the night because then 
Because I don't want him to leave when she's trying to... Yay, she's woohooing for the first time. <laughs> oh, look at her go. Look at all the little hearts. We're totally being... We're totally being peeping toms. I'm so excited. I hope this leads to a baby, guys. I really do. Part 60, her first baby. Yes. Okay. He was just being stubborn. And so we just really had to get that friendship up there. Which I should have remembered. You know, sometimes that happens. So. Oh. Oh. There she goes. Wow, she can hold her breath for a really long time. <laughs> She's definitely been in there for a while. Oh, yay. And then I'm gonna have ask I'm gonna ask him to spend the night just so that if she's not pregnant this time they can try again. Maybe they'll just have to try. <laughs> okay. So I want you to ask him to stay the night. Um okay, invite to stay the night. <laughs> So, and then hopefully he'll do it. Okay, a sleepover sounds great. Good. Okay, so now she's going to come over here and she's going to take a pregnancy test. Um, take a pregnancy test, and then we'll go from there. She's hungry, and she's, well, she's not really tired, but she's hungry, and she has to use the bathroom, so that's probably important to do. So, and this part might be a little bit longer than... I want it because I forgot to turn my timer on, but it's okay because I also really wanted them to. <gasps> yes! 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 Woohoo! Sorry guys, I'm super excited. Super, super excited. She is going to have a baby. Oh yes. This is what I'm talking about. Okay. And she's going to go tell him the good news. And he's just sitting in this room. That's kind of Down creepy. Him, yeah, Anyways, <laughs> now she's going to tell him <laughs> that she's having a baby. She's like, yay, we're having a baby together. You're my first. You're the first. Oh, okay, I'm so excited. We're going to have her flush the toilet. She's still very feeling very flirty, but we need to come and cook something. Let's have her cook some grilled cheese, and we'll do... The party size version after I get her to flush the toilet because yeah <laughs> something tells me she's gonna be throwing up at some point and so we want that to be taken care of so oh my gosh, I'm so excited. And she needs to eat he's going to sleep already <laughs> so at some point I'm not exactly sure when but at some point I think I'm gonna adjust the the house a little bit change things around so, um, it, as you guys might know, I'm someone who likes, I kind of like big rooms and I'm just not a huge fan of the setup here. And I don't like that we don't really have a living room or anything like that. So, um, I want to change some stuff around and make things a little different. I know we had talked about it a little bit in the, the other part. I just haven't gotten around to it, <laughs> but yeah. I, oh, I'm just so excited. Part 60. And she's having going to be having her first baby. Oh, she's come so far. Oh. Okay, there's parties going on. But, you know, she's going to be a mom now. And we should probably focus on that. And doesn't she have, like, exercise equipment somewhere? Um, I want to think there is. There isn't downstairs. Maybe it was upstairs. Was upstairs. Okay, yes, there was. There's exercise equipment up here. It's getting late, but I'm gonna have her do a workout and then take a shower and go to bed. So, um, like it's like 10:54 p.m. Yeah. Um. Oh my goodness. Oh, I'm so excited. That only took forever. Um. She's definitely gonna have to send him away and invite the next guy over, and that way we can work on just becoming good friends so now I want you to work out and push the limits girl we're gonna see if working out a lot is gonna make any difference in in the weight she gains or not I don't know but we're gonna attempt so every chance we get we're gonna attempt it so 
Yeah. Although it is getting late. So what we're going to do now is we're going to have her come over here and take a shower and use the bathroom. And then we're going to have her go to bed and then we'll pick. She's trying to scare him away. <laughs> She's like, all right, you got my daughter pregnant. Now go away. We're done with you. <laughs> I like how she was like shaking around the computer and stuff like that. So Destiny's energy is really, really low. Okay, we're going to wake her up. And we're going to have her cook some breakfast. We're going to do scrambled eggs with toast. And we're going to do a party size serving. So that way she has some food in the fridge. So, And I just want to get her cooking skill up. Uh, what is it? Everybody's calling her. Um, her cooking skill is almost a level 3. So that's good. I'm, I must be going. Yay! Bye! We're done with you. <laughs> that almost sounds evil. But we are. We're done with you. <laughs> She's like really hungry. Ooh, that looks kind of burnt. But at least she didn't set the house on fire. And she's a cookle. Cooking level three. Oh, sorry guys. I'm like burping like crazy. <laughs> Today, sorry, love day starts tomorrow. Ooh, show holiday objectives. I know this is a, a uh, um, seasons thing. But yeah, that's okay. So, holiday items, holiday decor. Okay. Huh. That's really weird. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Don't show holiday. So, yeah. So spend a little extra time with the one you love or the one you are falling in love with to participate do romantic socials such as kissing hugging flirting or if the mood strikes woohoo give flowers to participate use the purchase gift interaction on the phone or computer to buy flowers and select a sim and choose give gift and then go on a date take out that special someone or invite out a new soon-to-be special someone it's tradition to participate, click on the phone and select Ask on Date. Choose another sim and select a location for the date. Mm. So the question is, do we, when it when it comes time for that, do we want her to invite the guy that she's having a baby with? Or do we want to invite somebody else over, get him in a flirty mood, um, do all the flirting interactions and give him flowers and things like that and then go out on a date somewhere with him um, might be the best thing to do because in that way he will be all set up so that after she has her baby we can get her pregnant again right away so I'm actually thinking that that might be what we do but at the same time I don't know who to invite over we need to find somebody that we can try try Oh, 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 Just, it's, it, is it because of bad food? Is it bad food? Bad aftertaste from eating poorly made foods. Aw. Oh, poor sweetie. That's horrible. I'm sorry. <laughs> She's like miserable, but of course, you know, this is her first pregnancy. And then, you know, she won't remember it after that. I think she's throwing up. Yeah. Aw. Oh. Poor girl. Poor, poor girl. Okay, so we need her to clean that up and mop that up. Are bills here yet? No, but she can get mail, which I don't think we want to do yet. And then let's scrap that painting. So she can't continue painting it because it came with the house. She didn't actually paint it herself. So we're going to have her go ahead and scrap that. What does she want to do? She wants to cry it out. Why? Loss in the family. Oh, really? She's still upset over Destiny? Or not, not over Destiny, but over Sonya? Oh, the poor girl. Aww. Um, okay, you know, I actually want her to come over here, and I want her to practice 
practice programming. Because I think that's how I really wanted her to make her money. So she acquired the programming skill. And so I'm going to have her work on that for a bit. So, yeah, I know. She's very sad. She's, like, crying as she's programming. Oh, poor girl. <laughs> she's like, oh, you horrible. And she's thinking of... Oh, I wonder if her dad died, too. Although he didn't really look like a ghost in that picture, so I don't know. I don't know. She's probably just wanting her dad, seeing how her mom's gone. Aww. And she's got to feel kind of lonely, even with all of her siblings. Maybe she should have a party tomorrow and invite all of her siblings, and, and then that way they can all feel better together. So, I like that idea. So here's her summer wear. I wanted to show you guys real quick her summer wear. And she looks so pretty. So I just went with the classic black and some purple on her shoes. So I thought that that outfit just screamed her. So that's her summer. And here's her winter, here's her winter wear. So I think that's really cool. I like the, uh, the colors. It was just in the the full body suits and so I just gave her that and then just changed the color so I actually like that on her I think it looks really good so yay she looks so pretty but there she is there's her winter wear and there she is she's so beautiful so beautiful she is gonna make some beautiful babies I can't wait to find out what her first baby's gonna look like. It's gonna be a boy or a girl. I'm also gonna have her work on her photography skill too because I really want to have her take pictures with each one of her kids before they move out, which I attempted to do with Sonia, but it didn't work out very well because Sonia's um, computer or her um, camera skills were so bad that like all the pictures came out bad. So yeah, so for the first like five or six baby she's gonna have to take like 20 photos just so, for, with each child and hopefully one of them will come out decently so but yeah there she is and she's just she's so pretty so pretty so pretty for a second generation anyways guys I hope you guys enjoyed this part I hope you're as excited as I am that destiny is getting ready to have her first baby things are gonna start picking up now and in the next part we are going to celebrate the, um, the first holiday of The Sims 4 Seasons, Love Day, and she's going to try her best to invite a guy out on, that, on a date um, and get everything ready so that we can go right into having another baby. So anyways, don't forget to hit that like button if you liked my video, guys. It would mean a ton to me. Um, so please hit that like button, like, 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 like. I would really appreciate it. If you're new to my channel and haven't subscribed, hit that subscribe button. And I will see you guys in my next video. I hope everybody had an amazing day. Bye, guys.